What does Satanism mean to you? Satanism to me is has become increasingly multi-layered and complex in many ways in 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 uh, such a way that it, it can be hard for me to summarize properly. It means being um being just myself really. I mean it's it's easier for me to just live as a Satanist rather than describe what it's like to be a Satanist. It is separating yourself from the rest of the herd and living your life by a certain code. The thing that drew me to Satanism was as I was a child, I always felt, had this feeling that there was something just not right with what I was being told being brought up in a church. I think it is finally a way that people can approach and admit to those things which really are basic human nature. So we have no compunctions against somebody who um, is gay or transsexual or any anything like that. For me, it... Uh... Boy, that's a big question because for me, you know, it, it's it's the culmination of everything that you know free men are are born to feel and know. And in the most basic form, it's a philosophy to me that matched up with my natural way of perceiving the world around me. So the two, when when I discovered Satanism at a very young age, on paper in the Satanic Bible it actually you know, linked up correctly with how I was thinking to begin with. Um, yeah, I think um, the aspect of Satanism that most appeals to me is the fact that while it is essentially atheism, it also incorporates magic in a sense where we ritualize. Whereas a lot of times uh, people say, well, why would you want to be a Satanist? Why wouldn't you just say I'm an atheist? Um, well, an atheist is almost like saying, I'm not this. Um, a Satanist actually is saying, I am this. The more I researched, the more I realized my thinking is along the same lines as um, what Anton LaVey had codified in the Satanic Bible and subsequent books. And that what is what drew me to Satanism. In my life, it's just really been who I am since birth. Uh, the only difference being that when you sort of acknowledge it, that you just come into contact with other people who are like-minded and become, you know, acquainted with some really excellent people. Satanism to me is the religion that embraces the carnal rather than the spiritual. There are lots of other non-theistic religions throughout the world, but Satanism takes a very unique stance of being against the spiritual for the carnal and the flesh, indulgence over abstinence. I think it's also an opportunity to get at things that really motivate you. Crystallize those things that are important to you. Um, I think you need to, it gives you the opportunity, let's say, to dispel any of those paradigms or thought systems that you've been brought up to believe in. Well, it's part of my life that I'm very proud of and uh, I'm proud to be a Satanist, very, very proud. Um, for me, Satanism is a synthesis of the best of ancient pagan principles and uh, modern thinking that allows for a full and, and, and profound embrace of, of nature as it truly is, which means taking the good with the bad, but maximizing the good and infusing it with poetry. 
Freedom. It's the ultimate freedom. The ability to associate oneself with what the world perceives to be the ultimate taboo. Uh, all through my childhood, I had been fascinated with monsters, magic tricks, and pretty much at the same time, the occult was definitely appearing, appealing because it was similar in nature. So uh, out of reading all the books, I found all these witchcraft books, and I would read them and read them and read them. And the, the Satanic Bible was always there in the bookstore and kind of looming. And finally, I got that one and read it. And what happened was, it was the marriage of two idea, ideas. I'd been reading all these magic trick books and studying magic very seriously, and not just the tricks, but the psychology behind it. And then here's this, this so-called occult Bible, and here there's, all, there's a similarity to some of the philosophy on you know, what it is, what black magic actually is. It's, there's, a, there's a reality to it, a psychology to it, and an aesthetic to it that, that for me was like, oh my God, it's the same. They came together. It has a wonderful way of taking um, some of the more difficult uh, restrictions in culture and um, removing them. If you have the courage to dispel all that and get at what really resonates with you as what people are about, uh, what human nature is really about, instead of trying to suppress or overcome in some ideal thought system um, those things that people ought to be, those ideals that society ought to have, it gives you the chance to get at what's it, what is it really all about? What are people about? Let's get in touch with that.